Greetings. In this video, I'm going to give you a little information about the um, dish organite uh, and show you some feedback. So I'll start off right away with the dish organites. Um, feedback I've gotten in the past was about it uh, being great tool to meditate with. Um, also for one person, she said she was very lucky. Her family actually, they generated, manifested some money with it. For me, it was telepathy, and for several other people, it was uh, dreaming, vivid dreaming, and wildly vivid dreaming. <laughs> and so I'm going to show you some of that feedback, um, also give you a little bit of insight on how this works. Um, this is a dish organite. This one has only a frequency ring inside of it and the bottom that's beneficial. Some of them are much, much larger, as you can see here. They have biogeometric signatures and a frequency ring. Um, the frequencies can vary depending on need or desire. Now, they can also be in the receptive mode, but they can also be in the broadcasting mode, like here. This is pulling out, this is coming in. The um, Most people use the receptive mode because they really would like to get the benefit of the frequency, so this is a good way to, to hold it. In addition, I have measured the byproduct of the organ, uh, I'm sorry, of the scalar energy this dish organite um, creates. And it has gone up to, I think it was a half millivolt, some instances, very rare instances, even over. Um, most of the time, if they're sitting dry, you might only get 10 millivolts or 20. But if they're um, activated by spraying a little bit of water on them, and it absorbs right away, especially on the white part, um, they can go up to... I don't know, 300 millivolts, 400, 500, and so on, depending on, the, I guess, the individual make and, and shape or whatever it is. Um, it can take me several days to make one. I know this looks so simple. It looks a little clumsy, if you will, but I'm looking at results. I haven't figured out a better, smoother way to make it, but the feeling in my hand is great, and as you can see, it's well-loved. It's not like I don't use it. So this is how I connect my body's energy to the beneficial energy of the dish organite. Left hand uses the, the white, touches only the white part, which is the positive going into the receiving hand, the left hand. And the right hand here with this basically touches only the inside. The inside uh, where the dish is is a, a negative charge to it. And so just by holding this with um, a few seconds even with one finger, or I could actually do all the fingers through, I can experience um, uh, my en body's energy connecting to it. And I have media made videos before, like the small fingers that symbolize in the water in our body. Um, this one I should actually start this. The ring finger is uh, earthing. Middle finger is space. Um, I guess spiritual, and then uh, point of finger is um, air, I'm thinking lungs, breathing and all that, and then thumb is fire. So this is another part of it. But today I wanted to speak about another phenomena someone has experienced with it and the feedback I have gotten because I think it's pretty wild. So I always cover the uh, person's identity that is giving the information. Um, and... Uh, Hmm, where did I put this? One moment, please. Okay, I'm back. And so, uh, this is what he's writing. Um, well, he makes a compliment to start with. I'm awesome. And then, um, I want to increase my energy. And frankly, I uh, want to increase my testosterone so as to be more potent uh, sperm increase or quality. Like a... I guess he says, I like a bracelet made of the same energy or resonance. Yes, I totally believe in there being another layer. He says later, but it probably means layer to us. But we're just learning about our aura or chakras or biofield. And the dish organite gave me wild, vivid dreams. Came back from a travel assignment and my sister threw them out away didn't didn't know she didn't know what it was 
so that's too bad and that the communication there broke down that she didn't ask him um then i answer some things and make some suggestions and whatnot and then he gives me more feedback here says um sorry i'm trying to do too many things at once and it wasn't just me it was the whole family we all <laughs> We'd all be sleeping in the same bed and all wake up talking about our dreams. When they were removed from the bedroom, no one has dreams f from the same the, uh, from same night. So basically, when they removed them from the bedroom, nobody had a dream that they remembered. I'm not saying that they didn't dream, but um, that was their their thing so i'm very grateful that he gave that feedback but he also gave me some feedback here about those dreams there was a time that my son told me hey dad i was stuck in my dream and i couldn't come out and that kept happening happening to me so uh me and him shared our dreams and how we were stuck inside them we knew that we were in a dream but we couldn't get out of the dream they weren't bad dreams it was just knowing that you are in a dream and can't get out uh, wife and daughter didn't experience that, but I did, me and my son. And then he gives me more feedback here, because I asked him some things, and... I think it unlocked, like, a new level of dreaming. Uh, because that's, that's something that I experienced when I was much younger, but now, me experiencing it, with much more better memory of what was going on in my dream and how I was able to manipulate my environment and know exactly what was going on. So I think it enhanced it. Um, even now, when I'm not uh, remembering too well, I'm still able to manipulate it a little bit better. So I think it opened up uh, like a, a cheat code on how to remember it more. Uh, definitely not as vivid as it was when that thing was next to the bedside but it was, it's still something that I think it unlo unlocked some kind of potential that was there but we couldn't get to it wow I think that was some amazing feedback and interesting that he says that he sort of kept that gift even though the sister threw it out <laughs> as he um, wrote about it earlier I, she didn't know what it was she just threw it out while he was traveling I was like oh no <laughs> <laughs> it's so hard to make, you know, take a long time to make one, uh, especially with all the bio signatures in it and so on. But um, this is a very interesting feedback, uh, really one of a kind when you have an entire family getting dreams that same night and, and then not getting them when they put them away. So I um, just wanted to share this with you. Um, like I said, it's a, I always keep the um, person that is giving their info here so you can feel free to give your feedback and stay anonymous um, that way um, you know you don't get any crazy people saying weird stuff because just because they don't have the same experience that you do some people will carry on and do things and they can um, also the dish organized as you can see can turn out like real small uh, larger and uh, flatter and uh, you know then you have the um, broadcasting uh, mode like here where it's pointing out and then the reception mode this is how most people get them and rightly so i have to say because it seems like they receive more from it and they can connect in a different way so thank you for watching wishing you much joy and peace check the description in the video for more uh, contact info and such